I yeah. know you've got okay. your cynicism, but... No, no, because I know who gave them their instructions. Oh, yeah. Those old guys, pissed. if you're... Yeah. But we can supply that information. Yeah. Well, you can put back to Mr. Jones' officer, there are lots of us. He'd have to hire lots of people. What? There's only two of us. We, I know, we but I understand that you like you to uh, find out exactly how many of us there are. Just the number, yeah. Oh, For what reason? Hello there. <laughs> oh what? But you came and paid well, you not you personally, but several people came. You, we've had two visits from your officers today. Oh, have you? Yes, oh, we have. When? What? This morning. One yeah. very early and one a lot later. Oh, Sergeant okay. and a PC come along because a local resident reported that we were working here and went away, asked if one of us could drop into the station. Earlier on, we had a visit before that. Last night, we had two officers come up. I think the story the Echo's gonna get is harassment officer. More bloody wheels, I think, actually. Hello, how are you? Hello there. Speak through here, because technically speaking, under English law, officer, this is my front door oh, under section yeah. six, <laughs> and therefore, <laughs> and, unless I invite over. you in under English law, unless you you're pursuing a felon or you have a warrant, it's the same as someone's front door on a house under English law. Um, I'd like to know exactly why you've come, because as I told your colleague, we've had two visits today. Yeah, I've just been nosy, and this is my beat. Your You're my community policeman. Well, see, when I have three visits in one day off officers, uh, it seems to have very bad communications in their police force. As you didn't seem to know that we've already had two no. visits today. No, I didn't know. Um, why are you visiting us? Just to count how many people are here, as directed by my slip now. As Mr. Jones, yes. No, not Mr. Jones. No, no, Mr. Jones. I didn't know Mr. Jones was in the police force. I thought he was a man that owned the property. Mr. Jones, DJ Complex. Mm. So Sorry. I've been reliably informed. Yeah. You can tell Mr. Jones that there's about 20 of us. About 20? Yes, it fluctuates, see, because most of us are members of the local community on the estate there. So local? Some, yeah, like the estate there, I'd say that was pretty local. But most or all of you are local? I'd say most. I'd say 95% of us. One person is Well, the two stood behind you are members of the local community. How long is it going to be here? Um, well, it depends. If the CPO goes through, then we'll be here until they get a court order to remove us. If the CPO is turned down, then we will pack up and go because there will be no need for us to be here. Um, well, no, they intend. They well, it could be if it goes through. Yeah. All adults. Children do visit, but there are no children staying on site. Yeah, no. What do you do for provision? Someone else gets get shot. The cat. I thought. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Oh, all exciting stuff, isn't it? I'm going to protest about the traffic on Dorchester Road one year, do you? Pardon? I'm going to protest about the traffic on Dorchester Road. Yeah, I drove down there yesterday. It's amazing now, whenever there's a future traffic development, they change all the traffic lights and start roadworks along the bit they want the traffic off of. <laughs> I'll do with it. Yeah. Right. Do for me.